Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2020 Panini Legacy Football. Six box, half case, random team, break number four. Second half of the case, of the second inner case that we popped open from that master case. Circled four, because this is going to be break number four. Big thanks to all of these folks for getting into the action. There are the teams right there. Let's roll it, let's randomize it. One and a three, four times each. One. And four. After four, we've got Brendan O'Neill down to Kevin Smith. And one and three, four times for the teams. One, two, three, and fourth and final time. After four, we've got the Purple Birds on top, the Ravens down to the Texans. All right, so Brendan with the Ravens, Matt with the Rams, Nick with the Cardinals, Kevin with the Lions, Ron with the Redskins, Daniel with the Steelers, Brandon with the Eagles, Matt with the Falcons, Chris with the Giants, Josh with the Vikings, Ron with the Titans, Daniel with the Panthers, Ron with the Niners, Fuad, you have the Cleveland Browns, Ron with the Las Vegas Raiders and the Miami Dolphins, nice, Will with the Packers, Josh with the Chiefs, John with the Jets, Daniel with the Colts, Brandon with the Patriots, Diane with the Bears, Matt V with the Bengals. There you go. Fuad with the Seahawks. Daniel with the Chargers. Mike Cody with the Jags. Chris with the Cowboys. Karen with the Bucks. Jeremy with the Broncos. Fuad with the Bills. Rick T with the Saints. And Kevin Smith, you have the Houston Texans. I'm going to alphabetize by team. I'm going to pause the video just to allow you to kind of digest the teams that you have and see what you think you can get and um, perhaps trade if you'd like. Uh, checklist is in the chat if you're watching live. Pause the video. We'll be right back. All right. Welcome back, folks. Look at this. There was a trade and a big one at that. This is a pretty interesting trade. All right. So Ron trades his five teams, right, for one, the Bengals, Matthew V's Bengals. So let's move Ron into the Bengals spot. We'll put T next to there for trade so we know we can keep track of who draws first blood in the trade. And now Matthew gets the Raiders. Gets the Dolphins. So two opportunities in here as well. Gets the Niners. Gets the tight uh, yeah, the Titans and the Redskins. Good luck. We'll let, let's see let's see what happens. Yeah, Ron, definitely keeping it very interesting here. This is a this is a pretty spicy trade here. All right, let's print and let's rip. All right, well, good luck. John, uh, yes, it will, but probably not until, not for another couple hours or so. We still have to do one more mini break for that, unless that's sold out. It has not. So, so yeah, we have to do one more mini break. So if we, the sooner we do that, the sooner we can do that and the mixer. Otherwise, it may be even later for the mixer, or maybe we even run out of time. We don't want that. All right, I think I've got enough supplies here. Let's, I don't know. Let's let's roll with it. All right. So let's let's open up the checklist too, because I'm gonna need that to, to type in the hits. Uh, oh, you're on the west coast, so you're good. Okay. Yeah. It should happen. Josh Zamora. New at this, what exactly is the checklist for? I'm going to flip screens just for a second. The checklist is literally a, the what's in this product. So card companies traditionally um, will release what you can find in these boxes or packs. And so that's why we can use the check. Let's say we're let's say you want to trade. You want to know exactly who's in that, who has what team. 
right there. The print run column, that means how many were printed. So if I'm looking at here, it says Brandon Ayuk, uh, auto, under the lights parallel, except silver, card number 15 for the 49ers, 101 were made. I think that might, yeah, it'll, that'll be parallels too, but without the silver, so maybe, you know, there could be 25, of 49 of them, and then out of 25, and then out of five, and a one of one or whatever, whatever adds up to 101, and the one of them. But yeah, every sharp collector has groupratechecklist.com and cardboardconnection.com bookmarked because that uh, it's an important resource just to see what has what, what you can get. Because not every, you know, there may be the next 2020 product that comes, maybe not as much Brandon Ix, and more of some other player, something like that. So it's good to always check. And it's all especially helpful because sometimes they'll be like, for example, the Niners have a Joe Montana tarot card, a dare to tarot card. So that could be a potential chase as well. But not every product is going to have Joe Montana. Maybe some product doesn't have Joe Montana stuff. So someone joining the group break may be like, I don't want I don't necessarily want that because I'm mostly chasing Joe Montana's. All right, Eddie Jackson for the Bears to 75 is our first autograph. Oh, where am I? There's the uh, final printout right here. All right, so the Bears, that's gonna be for Diane. Thanks for joining Diane. You've got the first hit. And all these serial numbered cards, we'll, I'm gonna set aside, but we'll, we'll sleeve just in the interest of time. We kind of have a busy night. Um, but we'll sleeve and top load all of those before they go out. Joe Burrow rookie card, are you numbered? No, you're not. We've got Matthew Stafford to 150. I kind of don't like how the yellow parallel where the, where the serial number falls. This looks off center. Hits, of course, will top load. Gianni, there you are. I was wondering when you're gonna see that video. Congrats. Well, now that's that's only half the battle. The second half of the battle is actually getting those, getting one of those nice teams. There's Josh Jacobs from my Raiders to 100. Who got randomized by Raiders again? Las Vegas Raiders. That will be... Oh, Matt. Got him in a trade. That's to 199. And we've got a Notre Dame player here. We've got Chase Claypool. Three-color jersey. And autograph. I believe this is a Steeler. Yeah, Steelers. I think I'm out of those little mini post-it notes. Maybe I could think I could survive with just this much. Stay tuned, folks. Let's find out. Will Joe have enough post-it notes to last this entire break? You won't believe what happens in box number four. Pittsburgh Steelers, that'll be for Daniel Hayes. AJ Brown, Titans. All right, let's get this box out of the way. 
Ah, uh, you went you want with boat. It's all good, Johnny. Well, once things settle down, and uh, I mean, we'll we will be open to the public in a limited fashion. Once that happens, you'll be able to come and and hang out for a little bit. Yeah, that's a good one, HP. One simple trick to great breaks. Other breakers hate them. Should we just clickbait all of our videos like that? One simple trick to great breaks. What everyone's doing to pull Zions out of NT. You won't believe number six on the list. Jenny, what's going on? How are you? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Westchester builds. Are you a local? We're in Hermosa Beach. Right across the street from Chipotle in the new The Habit. Or is it just Habit? Burgers that just opened up in that little plaza. Yeah, we're doing a little remodeling for the next week or two, but once we're pseudo open to the public, we should be able to accommodate some people in the shop. Nick LaPlante, what's going on, Nick? How are you? Oh, got Jimmy Garoppolo to 249. Got a gold, sorry, Brian Urlacher gold mini, 25 out of 25, couldn't contain him. That'll be Diane and the Bears. Got a nice little soft mat right here, so helps out. We've got two out of 10, Preston Williams for the Dolphins. That's a nice low number. And Brian Edwards. Raiders. This Gamecock is now a Raider. A Las Vegas Raider. Let's go. Nice playmaker for John Gruden in that offense. Well, that's the last one. I don't think I'm going to make it. I don't think there's enough... Out of 10, Preston Williams is going to go to Matt V as well. Got the Dolphins, Raiders, and a few other teams in a trade. We got DK Metcalf to 199. And we got Donovan Peoples Jones. And Harrison Bryant. Not to be confused with Hunter Bryant, which I did a while ago before someone saved my butt. Harrison Bryant is a Brown. Hunter Bryan is somewhere else. Fuad with the Cleveland Browns. All right, next box. Wow, Nick Plan at your uh, LCS saw one out of five Zion Logo Man out of NT. Yeah, that's nice. Has that one of one been pulled? Is that bounty? Is that blowout card bounty still on? 
I don't. I think it's still in the title of our video. That's what we're we're still searching for it until it's found, or until we run out of NT basketball cases. <laughs> I feel like someone would have said it if that one of one logo man Zion was found. Now they said it hasn't been pulled. All right. Well, we do have a case of NT on our site right now. We've got to do a couple mini breaks and sell out some teams straight up on jazbeescasebreaks.com, but we can do it. With the proper motivation, I think we can do it. By the way, I am a little, we are a little booked up for much of the evening. So I know it sounds like Ted is doing a personal break on Instagram Live, but if you have, uh, if you're like, man, miss out on all the group breaks, you can join. Where's my, all right, there it is. So copy and paste that. We do have personal breaks on Instagram Live only, at Jaspi's Breaks, if you want to check that out. We've got a, ooh, that's a nice patch. Anthony Gordon. Where do you go, Anthony? Did you stay in? Yeah, I was going to say he's the one that went to Washington State and stayed in Washington State. He, he's going to the Seahawks. And that is two out of five. Seattle Seahawks, where are you at? That is Fuad with the Seahawks. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! Yeah, that is beautiful. I, I like the, the sort of pink magenta sunburst pattern right there, the cracked ice in the background. That must be part of the Washington State logo, right? Maybe that cat or something like that. Very nice. This legacy was pretty good last year. I feel like it looks even better this year. It tends to happen with most products. I think they, what, did, what happened? Did they end up canceling classics and maybe another set? And then it turned into this. That's what, what, what else? Maybe there was, or maybe they just canceled classics and turned into legacy. I feel like they canceled two product lines that maybe weren't doing as great or needed an update, and that turned into legacy. There's a gold DeAndre Swift. I think he's a lion. That's a 25. And there, there he is again, Anthony Gordon. It's oh, a nice looking Shelby. All right, another one for Seattle. I can save a save a post note on that. They're right next to each other. Out of two ninety nine, Baker Mayfield. Here's Russell Wilson. That's, that's who Anthony Gordon's backing up. More Seahawks. Fan favorites to 50. Out of 25, John Elway.
Wow. 1965 Shelby Cobra hammers at $950,000. I gotta, we gotta sell a lot more legacy football if we're gonna, if I'm gonna get Shelby Cobra money. <laughs> All right, next box. I've not seen a Dare to Tear card yet. Someone was mentioning in the chat earlier, they're not necessarily case hits. Maybe, maybe they naturally fall one per or whatever, but but doesn't mean they're guaranteed though, according to someone earlier. Well, let, let's, let's see what happens anyway. Here we've got uh, Courtney Davis to 100 and Jonathan Taylor Thomas. JT, you know, it's not Jonathan Taylor Thomas, but it's just Jonathan Taylor under the lights autograph. Jonathan Taylor is a Colt, and that's going to be Daniel Hayes. And that's for the Blue Horseshoes. Once again, Daniel Hayes. Fernando says, nice. He says, great, great, nice hit. He should be a great fit for the Colts. How are we, how are we feeling about the Colts this year? Philip Rivers on there. If Philip Rivers can turn back the clock even just a little bit, I mean, they still have some decent weapons on that team, right? If you like a decent offensive line, you still have T.Y. Hilton. And there's Hunter Bryant. We had Harrison Bryant earlier. This is Hunter Bryant. Hunter Bryant is a Detroit Lion. Detroit, that'll be Kevin with the Lions. It's TJ Hawkins for the Lions. All right, there's Julian Elliman to 100. There's under the lights, Joe Montana. I don't think those refractors are numbered, but they will ship. It's only veteran commons that don't ship. There's Tyler Lockett to 50.
over that Colts depth chart here. I'm curious. And the AFC West, or AFC West, AFC South is kind of soft, right? Could it be had? Colts, Texans, Jag Jaguars, Titans? Oh, Titans are pretty good. I mean, unless Ryan Tannehill turns into Ryan Tannehill and not like fresh legs Ryan Tannehill from last year. All right, so Phil Rivers on the Colts. He's got to turn back the clock just a little bit. Marlon Mack, Jonathan Taylor. Even have Neam Hines. I think he's so they got they got a few strong got an effective running back in Marlon Mack. And uh, maybe Jonathan Taylor, Neam Hines. Those guys are pretty good. T.Y. Hilton is still there. Paris Campbell. Doris Fountain of Youth. You know, oh, they drafted Desmond Patton too. So they got some Jack Doyles in the mix. They got some pass catchers. I don't know too much about their offensive line. I feel like that was a bit of a problem last year. So Jacoby Brissett was kind of running around. So maybe if they do, if they address those issues, that might be helpful. DeForest Buckner on the defense. Darius Leonard I really like. Rock Yasin, Malik Hooker. They got a decent defense. I know nothing about their, their kickers. Another punter. But the AFC South is not super not super scary. They kind of do their thing. Could be interesting. They could challenge the Titans. And let's see what let's see what O'Brien does with that Texans team. I don't know. Could be fun. Yeah, Fernando thinks that Rivers will ball out with the Colts. There's Matt Stanley. Nate Stanley. KJ Hill. From the Ohio State University. KJ Hill is a bolt, a charger. That goes to Daniel Hayes. Kind of crazy to think that the Chargers and the Rams are opening up SoFi to probably no fans. Ra my Raiders are opening up a new stadium in Vegas, probably no fans. Um. I feel like there's an... Oh, uh, the Texas Rangers baseball team. I think they had a new stadium too, right? Was that supposed to open this year? No fans. I think the Dodgers... My Dodgers did like a like $100 million in like center field concessions and restaurants and bar renovations behind center field in, the, in between the bleachers. No fans. <laughs> Out of 100, Dak Prescott... Are there any other new stadiums or any stadiums that have undergone big renovations that aren't going to get used this year? I think those are the those are the main ones that jump out to me. CJ Henderson to 299. And we've got 14 out of 100, Isaiah Simmons. Three color patch and autograph. Is he a, is he a Raider maybe? You know, Raiders drafted like half the Clemson team, right? No, he's a Cardinal. That's Nick T with the Arizona Football Cardinals. That's 14 out of 100. From a Tiger, from a Cat team to a Bird team. Fifty. Last box coming up.
Daniel Hayes has the Chargers in this break. Nice, a 1967 Gerhardt Ford Indy car on auction. I'm watching Meekum Auctions. <laughs> That's what it's come to without live sports. Which I, this is generally a, a Saturday or Sunday morning, you know, weekend, weekend hangover watching kind of thing. <laughs> Lazy Sunday afternoon kind of thing, but not live sports. That's it. Ninety-five thousand. I can. I can buy that. I can't. But I don't know. Some cars selling by millions of dollars. All right. Last box. Good luck, ladies and gents. We really appreciate it. Oh, points. Come on, we'll randomize that to one person in the break. That'll take the place of a, of a hit. Oh, 31 out of 50. There it is, a dare to tear Jacob Eason. Colts with that one. So they may not be, according to someone, they may not be traditional case hits, but they seem to fall about, at least in a small sample size for us, fall one per inner case. We've seen one in each one that we've, that we've done. Now, um, Daniel Hayes, you have until that last card right there, or I guess until I turn off the recording button, you have until then, if you're watching live, to decide whether you want to, uh, if, you, if you dare to tear it. Otherwise, we'll send it to you as is, and then you can make that decision later on. Um, what's inside is, I think, these mini cards, but none that you can find. Well, I think some of them are just normal, but then some of them can be uh, a Dare to Tear card exclusive from, from my limited understanding of this checklist. So I think it could just be, you know... Pat Tillman's nice, but it just could be that, or there may be an exclusive mini that you can find in those Dare to Tear cards. Something like that. I don't know. Cardboardconnection.com or, or uh, groupbreakchecklist.com may have some information on that. There's Jalen Hurts, under the lights. I think uh, Eagles, right? Yeah, Philadelphia Eagles. For the fly, Eagles fly. That'll be for Brandon Walker in Philadelphia. That's my last posted. Will I need to post post it something else? Maybe not, because the point took care of a hit. And we got the dare to tear. I may be in the clear. I may have just made it. There's a Joe Burrow under the lights. There's a Harrison Bryant. And we got a Cam Akers for the Rams to 100. And that is that. Wow, I just made it on post-it notes. Woo. <laughs> it's the little things in life, folks. Uh, does it have instructions on how to open it? No. It doesn't. But you can see there's like a panel right here, perforations here and here, and where it, I guess you, it naturally is supposed to fold right there. It looks a little difficult. 
I guess I have to maybe get a, a, a fingernail underneath and and rip that down and then fold it out like like doors. You know what I mean? That's that's my assumption. Or maybe like the edge of a knife. You can kind of to 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 get underneath. Silent. That's my assumption. And then, you know, like there's probably that mini card probably fits like, like right there. So I guess you have to be really careful if you use a knife. All right. Let's go back to the list right here. Nick T down to Matt. Everyone has a shot at the 400 points. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. One out of five, six times, name on top gets 400 points. One, two, three, four, five, and sixth and final time. After six times, there's six right here. A little consolation prize for Fuad with the 400 points. There you have it. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. I'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.